How are we doing guys? Welcome back to the Bonville Cocktail Collection. Now, as promised, we're gonna be looking at some summer cocktails. Now, to be honest, we've covered most of the big ones like the daiquiri, the mojito, the margarita. So be sure to go back through our old videos and get the recipes for those. Now, with that said, there's plenty of great summer cocktails you might not have heard of, and here's five of our favorites. All right, guys, first up, we're gonna do a drink called a bitter summer. This is a gin drink. We're gonna shake it. We're serving it long, but we're gonna start off in the cocktail shaker. 50 mils of gin. 10 ml Campari. 50 mils of fresh pink grapefruit juice. 10 mils of fresh lemon juice. Four to five nice mint leaves. Give them a little whack before they go in. Then five mils of passion fruit. You can adjust the amount of passion fruit syrup you want in there because that is literally the only sweetener. And as the name suggests, it's gonna be quite bitter. So that's it, we'll shake it up. This is gonna be served over crushed ice, so don't go nuts on the shake because it's gonna get that extra dilution in the glass. And you can find strain that if you want to get all the bits of mint out. Chuck that in your highball. Whack in your straw. Top the crushed ice. And then we're gonna garnish with a nice big grapefruit wedge and a mint sprig. And that is a bit of summer. All right guys, next up is an old match bar drink called a Nicholas Six Punch. Uh, super summery this one and very, very tasty. We're gonna start off with a cucumber. We're just gonna peel a bit of the end off and then we want about an inch. Dice that up and chuck it in our Toby tin. Then we want two nice strawberries. Take the stalks off and chuck them in as well. Get your muddler. Give that a good muddle. That should do. And next up, we've got 10 mils of lemon juice. 10 mils of simple syrup. And then 10 mils of, this is called a summer berry cordial. Actually, sorry, 15 mils. Any sort of berry cordial will probably do the trick. And then finally, our liquor. For this, we're gonna use Stolly raspberry. It's probably worked fine with any, like a non-flavored vodka, but this adds a bit of fruitiness. Shake that up. That, this can be quite nice served again over crushed ice um, in a long glass, but we're gonna serve it in a coupette. And then there's one ingredient we're missing, and that is a bit of pink fizz. So this is actually an English uh, sparkling wine, uh, but you can use pink champagne or pink prosecco, or whatever, and we'll just give that a top. And then we'll garnish that with just whack a strawberry on the rim of the glass. And that is a Nicholas Six Punch. All right, guys, this next drink is called a Green Swizzle. And I warn you, it's boozy and it's a bit weird, but I think you're gonna like it. This one dates back to the 1890s. Funny enough when this place was built, uh, but to a hotel in Trinidad called the Queen's Park Hotel. Now we're gonna start with Overproof Rum, Ray and Nephew. 15 mils. Next up, Velvet Falernum. I think you'll have seen this in some of our other videos. So, lime and clove liqueur with a rum base. 30 mils of that. 45 mils of white rum. 15 mils of lime juice. 
Now this next ingredient is optional and I don't think it was included in the original, but it's kind of got a nice minty freshness to it. So it's five mils of creme de month and that's it. We will give it a swizzle. So crushed ice. Pop that up, and we will garnish with a nice big mint sprig, wedge of lime, and give it a dash of Angostura on top. And that is a green swizzle. All right guys, this next drink is a twist on the super summery classic, the mint julep, and this is a mezcal julep. We are gonna start off by muddling a few ingredients. So take your Toby tin. This is another cucumber drink. So here is some peeled, chopped up cucumber. And this is a small jalapeno chili. We're just gonna take the stalk off that. And depending on how spicy you want this drink, either take the seeds out, leave them in, leave them in. Chop that up a bit, chuck that in as well, and we'll give that a quick muddle. Next up, some basil leaves. Now we didn't put them in the beginning because you don't want to bruise them too much, so we'll just chuck them in. And another ingredient, which is agave syrup. We'll just chuck 10-ish mils in there, depending on how sweet you want it. I'll give that a light bruise. And last but not least are, sorry, I know some of you hate when I say that. Last but not least, our mezcal, 75 mils. We'll give that a quick shake. Pull that into our julep cup. Top the crushed ice. Garnish with a nice slice of cucumber and a sprig of basil. That's the mezcal julep. Last up is a drink called a raspberry gin ricky. And this is a built drink. So get your chilled highball glass. We're gonna start with our raspberries. As many as you want, really. Let's go four. Give them a bit of a muddle. And then we're gonna go 20 mils of Fresh lime juice. 20 ml sugar syrup. Fifty ml gin. Nice variation. This is a like a south side Ricky, so you just take out the raspberries and put mint in instead. It's like a I guess like a gin mojito, really, really tasty. And uh, that's all the ingredients actually, so we're just going to go crush the ice, get your spoon in there, we're going to lift up the raspberries through the drink. If you wanted to, you could muddle in a shaker and pour it out so you don't get the bits of raspberries, but I quite like that. Get your straw, top of ice. Uh, if you want, you can top with soda, but <clears throat> um, yeah, why not? And then we'll just garnish that with a lime wedge and a nice raspberry. That's your raspberry gin, Ricky. 
All right, guys, those are five of our favorite summer cocktails that you might not have heard of. Let us know how you get on with those and watch out for that green swizzle. It's pretty powerful. As always, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, follow us on Insta, and we'll see you next time. Quite bitter, as the name suggests, so if you want it. <laughs> There's an outtake. Thought we weren't gonna get any, did you? Okay, we're gonna use Stolly Raspberry. We want 25 mils of that. Hold on. What the f***? It's your raspberry gin, Ricky. Ricky! This next drink is called a green swizzle. It's the, it's it. What was I trying to say? It's boozy and it's weird. All right, this next drink is a, Okay guys, last up is a gin called a, a gin? All right, last but not, I really hate it when I say that. <laughs>